What is going on YouTube? Old Tom, Rambler 69. Gonna do a quick mail call. A couple things come into the shop, and then we're gonna do a final on the James Morris Appreciation Build. First up, we got Dylan's new card over at NYS Modeling. That is a beautiful Foose truck, and uh, Dylan took that truck and made it his own, and just beautiful, beautiful paint job and, and uh, gloss finish, and love the wheels on it, and uh, I've been building models a long time, but I never built them that good when I was his age. So uh, he's a very talented young man, great builder, and uh, I was looking forward to seeing this at Acme this year, but uh, due to this uh, situation we're all in, that ain't going to happen. So uh, we'll see it at one of these years. So uh, thank you, Dylan. Appreciate it, buddy. And we got uh, Chris's card over at CD Scale Models. That came in, and uh, it's a great looking card. And uh, we appreciate the kind words on the back, Chris, and you're doing a, some really nice work over there. If you're not subbed to uh, Chris over at CD Scale Models, go check him out. My old buddy Joe over at Mad Genius Productions, he's been thinning his stash out. You've probably seen some other people who have been a recipient of his kindness. And uh, he shipped me this Tommy Grove kit. And uh, I didn't have this car. And he knows I'm a drag race guy, so especially the old stuff. So we'll get to it, Joe, and uh, we really do appreciate it, buddy. Thank you very much. So we'll show you what we got. It's a little different. We found some pictures of a one-to-one -one, uh, Liberty Walk GTR Nissan that the uh, company had done, and I liked it. And my good friend George Ramos, Vision 124 is his channel. He... Uh, He's inspired me for this whole build, and then he told me where I could go check out some aftermarket decals, and they just happened to have the decals of this other one-to-one -one car. So, here we go. This is what we got. It is, uh, this company had done a Zero Fighter tribute car, and I thought it was just, just loved it. Just loved the whole graphics and scheme of the car the flat paint and then you got gloss black on the spoilers and wheels and mirrors and it just really really stood out to me so uh, we uh, we did it up and uh, I think it came out really nice it uh, paint laid down it's Tamiya lacquer laid down super flat no orange peel at all and uh, with that being said decals there's always this controversy that you got to do a gloss coat but uh, if you get a flat finish and it lays down flat no peel and you got good decals there was no clear ever put on this model and these decals went on perfectly then I put a flat matte coat of Tamiya lacquer on top seal them up and we're good to go but uh, it's uh, a, just really happy the way it turned out with the matte matte paint and the gloss and uh, shot at the back we'll do a slideshow of the build pics and uh, and all that at the end so uh, we got some good final pics in my photo booth but uh, this paint you, normally you would have just did you know Japanese green wouldn't have been no 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 issue but I found this found this here it's made by a company called mini GT and uh, when I found it and got it I wanted to match the paint on it so they was close and I'm close I'm not perfect but I'm close and the, the Japanese green was too dark and I played with colors and different primers I end up shooting NATO green over a black primer and uh, that was the closest green match I could get and it turned out pretty cool I'm happy with it so we got a little 164 die cast and uh, I think that's going to look pretty cool. But uh, that's what we got. And uh, we hope you like it, James. And uh, hope you're getting better over there. And looking forward to some of your future videos. You're a pillar of this community. You've been, you're a great member. And uh, we do appreciate you. And uh, always enjoy talking with you at Acme. Always a good time. So uh, that's all we got. I want to keep you guys long. We're going to run a little slideshow at the end. Everybody take care. Old Tom, Rambler 69, we're out of here, guys.